Hello everybody, it's Dark Matter here with another exciting video just for you. Well, we glued that on there and we let it set overnight. So the glue is set. It's not cured yet. It won't cure for another two days. But it foamed all up just like I told you it would. Look at that. Foamed right up. But what we're going to do today is, well, we're going to sand that off. Alright, we'll take that off there, that excess glue. Sand up the stuff they got on everything else. And uh, then we're going to throw a, a coat of stain on it, what do you say? So stick around for the next episode, part four of A Walking Stick for Lily. Stick around. All right, everybody, got it all sanded up, okay? Got it all sanded up. We got it pretty, pretty. Got it all smooth. Look. All right. I had a little bit of problems getting in there. That was a tough spot. So it ain't as pretty, but it'll do, it'll do. Yep. Sanded the shaft down again. And now what we're going to do... We're going to put some oiler on it, some wood oiler, um, oil, uh, linseed oil, boiled, uh, the boiled linseed oil kind of oil. Yep, we're going to put some wood oil on it, and we're going to keep it from cracking. That's what that'll do, it'll, it'll keep it from cracking more than what it already has. Because there are a couple little cracks in it, but you know what? That just gives it character. And it doesn't take away from the strength too much. Uh, if you want something perfect, you know, go buy a wood dowel. You know, if you're going to take it out of the woods and try it yourself. Well, you're looking at, without cracks, if you're lucky, you're looking at probably a year, year and a half worth of drying time. And that's with the skin on it. All right, you got to keep, you got to cut it. Hurry up, get it home, if you ain't already at home. Um, first thing you want to do is take it right out and paint the ends of it. Paint them with uh, some kind of paint that will keep moisture out, all right, and moisture in for that matter too. And you leave the uh, bark right on it, and then you just let it dry. Put it up somewhere and leave it for a year or two. And then in a year or two, you may have a little bit of cracking at the ends. Maybe, maybe not, maybe not if you're lucky. Um, but yeah, that's how that works. This cane, however, was this year. Cut this year, cracked this year, <laughs> dried this year, so it's still kind of green. And then, you know, I don't know, two, three years, it'll be fully dry. It's dry to a point. But it's still got moisture in it, and it could still crack. Like, look, there's a little crack right there. See it? Yep, and there's another little crack right there. But like I said, it dried too fast. When they dry too fast, they crack. So it's all good. We're going to put some oiler on it, though. All right, we got the oiler on it. Oiler. Got the oil on it. And, uh, well... It don't look much different, okay? Really, honestly, it don't. But it, the oils in it, what that's going to do is it's going to hopefully keep it from cracking any more than what it already has. So, uh, well, I'll just throw a coat of uh, stain on it, guys, and I'll be right back. All right, stick around. All right, guys, got the first coat on it. And we're going to go for the second coat here. Give you a close up here but I can yeah it didn't take very well with the first coat didn't usually don't yeah that's it we're gonna put another coat on it 
and uh, well, <laughs> you know the drill. I'll get right back to you. All right, won't take you long. I don't think you want to watch me put stain on, so we'll just uh, keep updating you throughout the video here. And all right, guys, I got uh, two coats. Two coats of stain on it now and as you can see it's very pretty very pretty indeed indeed I guess I think it's good as far as being stained I don't think I'm gonna put no more on it it's got two coats on it a cherry stain on it and uh, I think that's good enough. I don't think we need much more on it. Gonna put a coat of finish on it now. Maybe, maybe two. I'm not gonna go overboard with it. Like I did the last walking stick I did. I went overboard on the finish. That's the stain. Alright, this is what it looks like before. Before I even put the finish on it. Alright, so it's pretty shiny just on its own. And uh, I think it turned out pretty. I think it's pretty. So, with that being said, I'm going to get some... Uh, finish on it and we'll get right back to you all right everybody there she is it's all finished and pretty all finished and pretty yeah well with a labor of love let me tell you Now, to be honest with you, it probably look better with 12 coats, but unfortunately, I'm not doing 12 coats. It's a lot of work, a lot of work. But you know what? That was worth it. I got me a pretty picture. My little Lily got a beautiful walking stick that she can you know, use for Halloween or whatever she wants to use it for. Okay, well, that's the finished project, and you guys got to see that. And I'm happy you guys got to see that. If you've watched this, these videos and you've enjoyed them, you know, hit the like button down there and maybe subscribe to my craziness. And uh, remember that uh, time is short. We don't get much time on this earth. Make it count. This is Dark Matter with another exciting video. I hope you've enjoyed yourself. This is Dark Matter and I'm out.